Hi it's Angie, I'm coming on today um, to unbox a Secret Santa gift. Um, so this Secret Santa was hosted by Woolly Staff. Um, I've had my box now for uh, about three or four days. Um, it came last week, or earlier this week I should say. Um, so we were given a name of somebody to make for and then obviously we don't know who who has um sent to us so we have to guess uh now there's quite a lot of ladies that are taking part in this swap that i'm not overly familiar with and i'm not really sure the kind of things that um they would make so i'm not sure if i'm going to be able to guess mine or not so it's like really oh <laughs> it's really weird receiving something so gorgeous and not knowing who it's from so it came obviously wrapped in paper and it had some really nice stickers on the front um on the sides and that so i've just unwrapped it and um it's got it's in this absolutely beautiful purple box and purple is one of my favorite colors so i'm absolutely made up just with this box let alone anything that's inside so it measures 23 centimeters square so it's a really nice box really sturdy so let's have a look inside oh my goodness it's so pretty so there is a box i think yeah like a handmade box inside i don't know how the best way to show this is um it's wrapped up with this beautiful like a like a vintage green ribbon and it's got a paper i don't know if you can see like the paper bow that's handmade on the top and it's got really gorgeous paper really beautiful embossed paper and then there's christmas tree paper and there is a note so let's have a look see if i get any clues <laughs> i need clues i need help <laughs> it says hi angie here is your secret santa gift as part of the woolly staff secret santa group I have enjoyed putting this together for you and I hope you like what I have sent. It will be interesting to see if we can work out who's sent to us. Have a fabulous Christmas. Keep safe and well. Crafty hugs, Santa. Ah, oh, so it's from Santa. <laughs> so, right, let's see how I get this box out of here. It's quite a tight fit. You did well. Whoever it is got did well to get it in. Oh. Really not sure how to get this out actually um oh there we go there we go just pop that box to one side and you can see on the sides of the paper which is the same as the front it's got this gorgeous thick um sort of foiled paper i was going to say embossed but it's not it's foiled and then this lovely um christmas tree paper and it's really thick really lovely quality paper and i don't want to open it it looks too pretty <laughs> now then i'm just wondering how i can open this without sort of destroying it ah there we go just popped that off save that to reuse it's always nice to reuse our ribbon so let's take the lid off there just pop that to one side for a minute and it's filled with lots and lots of gorgeous little boxes and really interesting looking little packages and chocolate i see chocolate i zoom in on the chocolate there's these two chocolate lollies there we go, I'll share those with Hobby. Right, I have a pen box. Now, I don't know if that is from... There's obviously like a, a an empty one. I don't know if that's to put something in or whether that's just for me so I can use it. So let's pop that to one side as well. That's really nice paper, actually. It's got like... It's got beautiful like autumn berries on it that is nice very pretty oh i don't know where to start there is a little vellum envelope which i think has been handmade yes it has been handmade with some poinsettias in 
it's just sorry I don't know if I'm in the shot I can't use my big camera arm at the minute I did one I did a video with it on the other day and it nearly killed my neck trying to look underneath so I'm back to doing it like this I'm afraid but well, these are beautiful gosh these are these are handmade as well whoever it is has got a lot of patience <laughs> show you Hang on. absolutely beautiful poinsettias and they're handmade and finished beautifully on the back lovely colours little stamens in the middle of those So that's those. Oh, gorgeous little owl napkin, little Christmas owl on that napkin. That's really sweet, isn't it? Then there's this little box here. I don't know if there's something in here or whether it's just a box. I can't quite tell that's also just a box that would be nice to send like a pencil or a Christmas pen something in really nice paper then there's some of this uh, like cellophane wrap that's made into a little envelope that's a really good idea uh, now where'd you get in uh, pretty sure this is the top somewhere oh here we go oh, is it Oh, no. Ooh. I don't know. I think I'm going to have to snip the top. I can't find a bit to open it. And then at least if I snip it, I can reuse it. What we like, eh? We always have to reuse everything, don't we? So there are some sparkly um, stag stickers. They're really nice. Nice thick silver glitter on there. some of these stickers that are made out of like little tiny tiny gems um something behind it really pretty hi sorry about that i just had to pause my camera where was i yes so that's the little packet that the stickers came in just pop that up there and then there's another one here another one of these little packets these are a great idea i think i've got some of this cellophane with some sort of christmas decorations on that i used to use for work um but now i'm not doing the stuff like it's left so it'd be a good idea wouldn't it to make it into pockets just got to try and remember to come down a bit lower so that i'm actually in frame so there are some little um like little favor boxes cut outs um, and these are really gorgeous like vintage papers i like vintage i really like the vintage um vintage christmas very pretty very nice flowers all right i'll just pop those back in there and i'm still absolutely got no clue who this is <clears throat> that's nice it's a stamp it says merry christmas and that's kind of to, to take it out of the bag because it's glare it's like a really sort of ornate sticker um stamp that you could use on like an envelope uh what does it say something around the outside oh it says something in script around the outside but i can't quite <clears throat> work out what it says don't know if that's going to focus too it's because it's glaring quite a bit that's really nice that really would look nice on you know like on the back of an envelope that's that then there's some let it snow christmas tags i've actually got the bows and the flowers in there but i've never had the tags so that's really nice that's that 
Oh, I love all these little envelopes that, have, that you've made out of vellum. Um, really, I'm trying not to dis to sort of destroy them opening them. I think this one maybe opens here. I don't know. Ooh. This looks. Oh, look at that! It's quilled snowflake how beautiful is that i used to quill years ago but i haven't done it for years absolutely beautiful so delicate but when they're actually put together they're so sort of um strong and it's got i don't know if you can see but it's got um glitter on it glitter all over it i think you can just see it glittering there on the camera so it doesn't get then we have oh that's nice just noticed that sort of in the middle of my box with my name on that's nice is that a is that one of those um so i'm just trying to look at it one of those i was going to say scratch and sniff scratch art you know where it's black and you like draw on it to reveal the colors is that one of those i haven't seen those for years used to love those when I was a kid um I'm sorry I'm gonna have to just cut the, a very tight tiny bit off the top of these envelopes because it's hurting my hands to try and open it then at least I can reuse it let's have a look I can't um I don't think that needs a bit more that's it what have we got in here oh some bells they're pretty oh they're double sided they're pretty it's got uh, like an old fashioned Santa I'll come back a bit an old fashioned Santa and they're double sided and again there's like a like a, um, an angel type that one and then that one really nice really glittery as well let's just pop those in there oh it's so exciting <laughs> and these look like some die cuts it's just well oh, these are pretty There's some different like gold die cut snowflakes. Aren't they gorgeous out of like some um gold it's not miri but like a really like shiny gold card. That's a particularly nice one. That's a really perfect sort of snowflake, isn't it? That one. So pretty. I've got some small snowflake dies, but not big like that back one. That would look they look nice with the poinsettias that my secret santa made gold and red just look lovely don't they oh i don't know where to go next there is some alphabets oh, they're nice some uh, two sheets of alphabet stickers in um like an old-fashioned holly and berry um design you can see Let's see if i can see them there that's really nice so that the two sheets obviously form like like the whole alphabet then there is this beautiful design pad that's nice because it's not necessarily christmasy it's quite wintry i like wintry well, I'm not very good at flicking through. Yeah, very definitely wintry. That's perfect. I love things like that. So thank you very much for that. That is really lovely. Then we've got this box with um, this beautiful... Let's get it the right way up. It's 
beautiful red bow and some ribbon. Oh gosh, it's got this on it and it opens out. That's a clever idea, isn't it? Oh, it's got, is it Lindor chocolates? Yeah, Lindor chocolates. They are just one of the nicest chocolates for Christmas, aren't they? They are gorgeous. I'm going to have to hide those. <laughs> no, not really. I don't mind sharing. <laughs> oh, beautiful box. And also the, um, the box is handmade as well, which is lovely. Really pretty little box there. Just pop those up there. Then, oh, we have another little envelope. Um, just trying to work out how to open this one because it's quite don't want to go oh little flowers little like an unusual type of flower i remember making something similar years and years ago where you kind of tea bag fold the papers into like quarters and then you stick them on like a circle kind of thing so there's um like some christmas script on that one that's pretty that'd be nice for spring Got a little sunshine and a yellow flower and that'd be nice for spring as well got some um like butterflies with a little green enamel dot they are nice i'll put those in my um i've got like a box of like all sort of odd embellishments and things just put that to the side a minute then we've got two envelopes we've got a red one and it looks like this has got some tags inside some beautiful handmade tags a little Christmas tree and some glittery holly and berries and that one that's pretty some layered paper some beautiful um, ribbon at the top you can write on the back and then that's nice it's a christmas tree that could be an, an embellishment or a tag and there is a piece of string in there so if you did want to use it as a tag you could put the string on or um as i say you could use it as an embellishment just pop these back in here And then lastly, we have another little envelope, which is made of beautiful paper. It's all embossed and glittered. And that is full of all sorts of little gold stars. So there's some fabric ones. Then there's some, I think they're card, but they look like, you know, that like leatherette fabric. That's what they look like. There's different sizes. So there's, oops loads and loads in there and there's also some silver ones as well silver there i'm not going to get those all out because i'll probably drop them all over the floor so that is my secret center and the paper there is let it snow echo park so i have absolutely no idea who this is from <laughs> um I honestly really don't know. I couldn't even guess. Um, I don't sort of recognise the style of crafting. So I have absolutely no idea. Hopefully, um, maybe, well, I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to get a clue. <laughs> when I watch, when I, maybe hopefully when people put their videos up, I'll maybe see who it isn't <laughs> and sort of narrow it down. I really don't know. But whoever it is, thank you so much. It's absolutely beautiful. And it is so nice to, to get something that is like a total surprise and you don't know who it's from. So thank you for the boxes and the outer box. They're all so really beautifully made. So hopefully I will at some point know who my secret Santa is. Thanks everyone for watching. Bye for now.